Hey folks, I'm Philly B, and welcome back to Stellaris. We are here with an Anite 1 Collector's playthrough, and after a brief break in recording for me, I've let uh, all the recordings catch up to hear your comments, and uh, so some interesting thoughts. One in particular about ship design, which I've taken to heart, uh, and seems that largely my existing ship design was not too bad, but there were some good suggestions, so let's go through what I've done. Uh, they suggested using frigates uh, if they, we, I wanted to. I'm still uh, out. I don't think these are particularly good addition to the game, so I'm not going to include them in my fleets, which is fine. Uh, but I have updated my corvettes to be with uh, um, phase disruptors here. Um, and the point defense to help be the front line thing. I've also updated my screens. Uh, with, I think, just the point defense now. Yep, yeah. and I gave them missiles. I think that's changed. Oh, this one is supposed to be Guardian as well. Although, I'm going to keep Flak on one, just in case. Um, oh, here's the screen version too, sorry. Yeah, this is with uh, base disruptors instead of missiles, and then just one point defense. Little concerned that one point defense is enough, but I'm more than willing to give this a try to see if it works. Updated the gunboat slightly uh, to, by giving it thrusters. Um, really not much of a change there. Uh, the carriers, I did upgrade the battleship carriers. I gave them the X weapon in the front, and I think that's a good idea there. It's a little bit less uh, strike craft because you can have a strike craft thing in the front here, but it's only one. I think this is probably better. Uh, missiles here, and I don't have the kind of missiles they were uh, talking about in their post. Uh, whirlwind missiles, I think they are. I don't think I have it re uh, researched yet. I think they come from the Swarmer missile tech, and I don't think I have any of that. Um, not 100% sure. There's a lot of different kinds of missiles in the game, and torpedoes and stuff, and I get a little confused between which one is which and which chain. Perhaps something they could clean up a little in a future edition uh, or a version of the game, but... Uh, I'm just going to put the uh, railgun here instead. Um, it's got good range, and these guys are going to be at pretty far range anyhow. Uh, I've left the arties here, but I've changed them to have a spinal mount with the arc emitter. Uh, I've added hardening to these two ships uh, also, so this will um, increase the uh, shield emitters uh, that would... Uh, and it helps uh, eliminate, uh, not eliminate, but mitigate some of the damage from weapons that bypass shields and armor. I think I did the same to my cruisers. No. Oh, just the uh, the two battleships. And I don't have the uh, Titan yet, but it's uh, being uh, researched. So this will be the fleet types that I'll be going with, and I'm going to upgrade my current fleets to, to reflect some of that. But i got to wait until I get... Um, uh, more alloys. For some reason it's saying I don't need to do this. Oh, I know. I have to switch the uh, the version type. That's right. That's right. And I can do that. Oops. Did not mean to do that though. Guys can merge together. Please and thank you. There we go. So it continued to build up, as I mentioned. I also went through all my planets and I did a bunch of stuff. I cleared a bunch of tile blockers, activated the tile blocking clearing edict uh, to help me get through that quickly. Um, did some more construction on planets to optimize some, added more research to the research planets, added more mining and stuff to those planets. I noticed that my energy credits are a little low, so I upgraded the energy credits uh, ones. I also upgraded some of these um, star bases uh, with stuff that's missing. Um, and I'm going to work to make these star bases better. I'm going to add also a third, or sorry, a fourth um, ship construction spot over here in uh, Ilya. I only have three at the moment, and so I wouldn't mind getting a fourth fleet going, as well as um, a place to uh, build things, uh, more ships, so over here is good. It's almost on the network, so I think that's okay. 
This guy's done here, so I want to build the hyper relay station over there. Continuing to hook up all the hyper relays to all my planets to help out there. It's coming along. I'm gonna go up to speed too because there's not much going on now, but I gotta make sure I keep upping my strength whenever I can. So first I'm going to um, modify these ships. Get them to upgrade. That's 350, you can do it without any cost. Yep, yeah. okay. We'll get all the uh, I hear a lot of the blocker cleared because I cleared all the blockers on all my planets. So once that's done, then we'll build more. We'll convert the other ships over, and then we'll uh, we'll do what we can do. Climate restoration is not particularly useful for our empire, but it is something. Mega shipyard is probably something I'm going to want. This is also good. Upgrade capital buildings. Uh, let's do this one. Mega shipyards. Oh, I am building another shipyard here too. Yeah, I forgot about that. So I'm gonna have five shipyards. That's fine. There we go. The quantum catapult has been restored. The restored quantum catapult in the Taramba system has been restored to operational capacity. Can now transport our fleets across the galaxy. Super. Research complete. Quantum catapult. Probably got that for completing the thing. All right, so secondary fleet, you're done here. Let's go into the fleet thinger. Now, if I wanted to change you to retrofit to two, please, yeah. I want to retrofit the screens to screens two. That looks good. And I'm going to do the same to these Corvettes to Corvettes two. Screens to, uh, screens to, and Corvettes to, Corvettes to, and screens to, screens to. That should help. I should probably want to cut down on the number of these, especially the brawler class, and increase the gunboats. But I'll get to that. So you're done now, so I can do this. Upgrade all those ships. Super. All right. Ancient drones reaching past the skies. The old drones, uh, fitfully adornment on Storm's Prime's moon, have become active again, and their work is a mixed blessing. Under the cover of night, a spotty airspace surveillance, they have erected a framework for some gigantic structure uh, a short distance away from our primary settlement on Storm Prime. Our engineers are convinced uh, it is the realization of some outmodded, outmodded, hold on, outmoded concept known as the space elevator, perhaps a common sight in the times before we nanite ones took to the stars. It will eventually have to be raised as it stands in the way of our expansion plans for our colony, and bringing it down safely will require some time. At least our engineers are giddy with excitement with the project of studying the thing up close. Good for them. That's fun. I don't know if you remember, but those are uh, little ships that we discovered on the moon. Little, uh, whatever it's called, automated um, intelligence like mechanical intelligence or machine intelligence uh, that were much stupider than we are because we are machine intelligence as well and they had some sort of outdated programming that they were wanted to complete and when we reactivated them or reinitialized them or whatever we did uh, they went and did that on the planet and that's the culmination of that Let's take a look at our fleets. Is everybody up to 170? They are, right? Everybody's at 170. 
good stuff. Would like more carriers than already, if I can. Yeah, okay, that's all that. Let's uh, reinforce all. And then uh, you're done here, so I'd like you to come over here and build that. And you're done here. All these planets are together now. That one's being done as we speak. This is all done. This is all done. I do have a guy coming up that way. All right, so let's have you come over to Great Wound, I guess. Oh no, I have to go this way. So here, this one. Century Array is done, all right. Upgraded. And you guys can upgrade your ships. Cool. Blocker cleared. Excellent. I'm going to start working on a fourth fleet now. Um, let's build it off of uh, two of those. Construction complete. You are done here. Yeah, I'd like you to start building um, ring worlds. I'm trying to remember what they all do. I know one enhances unity. So where are our unity planets again? Thriving green is one. Sure, we can go there. That's uh here in the Wena system. Okay. You build me a orbital ring, please. Get a few of those orbital rings built. Once the one in Wayne is done, I'll be able to see what the other uh, ring upgrades are. I don't remember off the top of my head. I know there's one that enhances unity. I think one enhances defense, maybe? Ships upgraded. Anyhow. Free minerals, no complaints, thank you. This could be advantageous. Just the parameters. Uh, this is in the Viric system, excellent. I would like you to be a new fleet. So let's consider the the combination here. So we want, let's say, 15 of these. Yeah, add ship design. I'd like the screens. I'd like the gunboats. I'd like the carriers. How many screens would I like? Maybe about 10 sounds good. Let's get some gunboats going. Get about um, 16 of these. And then uh, some carriers. Seems good. I think I'll fill the rest out with the, uh, the corvettes here. Looks good to me. Let's get some of that going. Oh, and I want to rename you to uh, the fourth fleet. There we go. Construction complete. Well, somebody's about to declare war on us. Let's see you guys. 
do have a big fleet up here. Let's get our second fleet up here as well. Um, let's get our third fleet up here as well. Let's make sure these stations do have defenses. Yeah, you've got six. You've got six. You've got two. You're also building some stuff right now. Let's build one more there. Locker clear. Let's check our um, strength here. Get rid of uh, fallen empires, primitives, and others. So their fleet power is inferior to us, but everything else is equal, it's okay. They're superior in all ways. They're nothing compared to us. Yeah, the Brennans are bad. They're nothing compared to us. Superior. Superior. Yeah, we have four empires that have a bigger fleet than us. We still gotta work on that. Well, we'll get there. What do they got here? Not enough. Well, they do have an 80k fleet there. It's worrisome. But our fleets are coming up. What else do we got here? Ah, there's the Titan. Okay, let's get the advanced afterburners. Let's get Titan assembly here. Uh, you're not the max level. That's unfortunate. It's Bovair. You are. We we'll get one Titan here. How many Titans can I have? Four. Okay. We'll get one there. You're not at max level. You're not at max level. You are. So we have the other Titan over here. And they have to work on upgrading our capital to the max level. I thought it already was, but apparently not. In the meantime, we'll continue to have our fleets upgrade. Construction complete. Construction complete. Good, you're done here. Let's have you come down to Helmar here. I know we got two fleets up here. Uh, they decided against it. They've decided against it, and I'm going to move the second fleet back down to uh, Bovatir. I'll keep the two fleets up here, though. So this and this, these two are at war. Okay, so you are superior to me. And you are superior to me. Good, they're at war with each other. Uh, this might be good because you have the other race here. Yes, these guys as your vassals. So it might be worth us attacking over here. If I'm going to do that, then I'm going to want you to stay here. Yeah. I'll think about it. Let's get another leader. We'll get you. Uh, we'll get this going for a little bit more strength down here. And you're done here. Uh, I need a little bit more stuff to build the hyper relay. There we go. 
I'm just building this to connect the empire up this way. Oh, here we go again. An estranged relative. Frantic signal bursts from the moon alerted us to the fact that the old drones on the planet have woken yet again. This time they bring us a significant prize as they have unearthed an ancient satellite from the depths of their moon and partially repaired it. We do not know how the satellite ended up there, nor why the drones have ignored it until now. Regardless, even if the fragment of its data banks have survived, there are a lot we can learn from the day-to-day -day life of the empires, of the, of the drones that once served. Cool. Got a whole bunch of stuff. Remember to take advantage of this, but... I've got to keep building up my fleets here, and I really want to get those um, Titans built. Yeah. Which reminds me, we should probably design the Titan, so let's do that in a second here. Uh, swarmer missiles, yeah. Ooh. Well, let's get the swarmer missiles out of the way. So I think that's the whirlwind missiles that the one commenter was talking about. Thank you again for all the comments that people give on my videos. I do appreciate them, even if it's just to say, hey, I like your videos. Um, ship designer, new ship. Titan. So the Titan we were thinking of, let's pull my notes over here. I got my own thoughts on Titan, but we can talk about uh, what they have as well. So we definitely want the Titan bow slot, because that's the only thing you can put there. And then it was a lot of kinetic large weapons. I think the only thing you can put there is a cross is all that. So the Perdition Beam, the only thing I can stick there, that's fine. Some kinetic weapons, times six, I think. Nice good damage. Uh, let's stick some shields. Stick four shields. Let's stick four neutromine. Let's stick some crystal planing as well. Let's we'll stick some hardening. Let's stick some hardening. Um, what else would I put here? Afterburners? I mean, evasion is not going to really help. It does increase the sublight speed though, which allows them to move around faster. I do like the hull tissue too. Let's do the hull tissue. It's not a great boost to repairing, but it's okay. Now, what do I want to do here? This is a good question. Because your defensive aura, which gives hull regeneration and arm regeneration, could increase tracking. Could increase ship fire rate. Really reduce the combat disengage chance. Negative ship fire rate on the other side. Or shield hull points. Well, shield I don't really care too much about. Hmm. Let me just think here. They all seem good, right? It all depends what you want them to do. I'm leaning towards the one that stops them from jumping away because I'm finding in the last two wars, enemy fleets were fleeing the battle and just coming back. Whereas if I can eliminate their fleet, that really puts me on an advantage.
The other one I'm thinking is the, um, so this is the quantum destabilizer. That's the other one I'm thinking of, where the ship uh, fire rate is reduced. Or this one, emergency FTL cool, cooldown and uh, combat disengage chance. Let's do this one, combat disengage, I think. Yeah, we'll do that for now. Let me know what you think, but I think that's, that's probably the best for now. Yeah, and uh, we'll just call this Titan. Hope we can auto upgrade as well. There we go. Uh, and they made something called the Titan, and I don't want it. I only make my own things. I should probably build a few ion things as well. well we'll get to there. Uh, let's continue to build up ships. You definitely need more ships, so let's do that. Let's see if my timer is at a while. Okay, we just have a little bit of time left. Should upgrade these as well. Construction complete. Construction complete. Yeah, you should all upgrade. I want you upgrade as well. And why don't you upgrade as well? It'll upgrade all the thrusters. Uh, is there more to upgrade here? Apparently. And let's continue to build. There's the Swarmer Missiles. Ooh. Hall Points. Yeah. Let's get Battleship Hall Points. Ships upgraded. Those are important to have. Uh, First Fleet needs to be upgraded again. We can build a little bit more while we're here. Really do have to get on building some of these uh, mega structures, especially the science nexus would be probably good to build. Is this done? It's done. Cool. Uh, I'd like you to build one in the capital, please. So why don't you come do that? Uh, you can build orbital ring. Here, please. Ancient drones debacle. The erratic behavior of the narcoleptic drones have taken a violent turn. A number of them have woke and entered the atmosphere of Storm Prime. As their want, they only slam into the surface of the planet at full thrust, repeatedly in many cases. Damage to the colony was neg negligible. Damage to the colony was negligible, but the nigh invulnerable drones were destroyed in bright showers of blue sparks, indicative of the uh, tremendous force of and dedication to their self-destruction. Weird stuff. I don't think I've seen that all the way through. I've seen some of it, but I don't think I've seen it all the way through. All right, let's go to Wana here. I've got the... Um, this going. So for now, let's build uh, an anchorage on both of these, but we need to upgrade this uh, to the next level. And I think that's when the the planetary bonuses appear. It's on level two. Blocker cleared. Oh, 
Well, hold on. Before I do that, I should take a look at... Add design to the fleet and add the... I cannot add this. Okay. Uh, let's knock that down one. Can I add the Titan now? I can. That gives me a two spot left over. Um, let's go to the screen. What about you? Yeah, I take you down. Not have that carrier, even though I really want it. We'll stick that instead. Be your 180. Uh, you can lose. Which of these? Worth? Is that 15? 60. Right now you have 9, so I need 6. Oh, this is 4. So a 16 would be 64. Um, yeah, I can't add this yet. All right, well, we'll go to fourth fleet here. Uh, let's take away two screens. Add ship Titan, not yet, not quite. 10, he needs 6. Are you 6? You're 4. And you're 8. Okay, let's get rid of one gunboat and one more screen. We'll add the Titan. Perfect. So it's just this one that's missing a Titan now. Um, I'm going to have to get rid of... But what I need, I gotta get down to a four, so it'd be three. Let's get rid of uh, we'll have one of these, and we'll get rid of two brawler class destroyers. Yeah. Okay, so that's fleet one. Um, split off two brawler class destroyers. One, two. Okay. Let's give you your own captain. There we go. And I'm going to have you sail over here. And I'll make a fifth fleet over here. Probably takes us to the end of the episode now. We've managed to do some cleanup here. We avoided a little war while we continue to uh, build up. We got our Titans done. We got our world set up, we're getting some ring um, stations done. We've gotten pretty, uh, pretty far along here. So, hope you're enjoying the series, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.